uh, right from the time of the advent of Islam into the subcontinent, this religious factor was operative. And in the minds of the Arabs and Turks who came to India, they were very clear that the rest of the people are kafirs. And they have to be treated differently. They have to be paying the jazia. They have to be given minimal representation in government. Their sacred sites and sacred structures do not have to be respected. They have to be vandalized. So much so that in the entire North India, in the 18th century, there was hardly a standing temple left.